welcome to vlogmas day seven i made a delicious coffee i got the inspo from our vlogmas queen remy and it's just one of my nespresso pods and i put in the starbucks salted caramel creamer i just got it from target and i added a couple splashes of the peppermint bark the skinny syrup so it literally tastes like a white mocha peppermint what is it peppermint mocha yeah it tastes like a peppermint mocha and it is delish. So today is Monday. I woke up early today. I have to edit the vlog that's going up today. So I woke up early to do that. And I have a lot of things I need to get done today. I have a lot of admin stuff. I have some emails to answer, invoices to do, a lot of like things to read. And I have a separate video that I have to, to do. I have to do a voiceover. And it's gonna be a video that is not part of Vlogmas. It's a separate video that you guys will see soon. So I hope you guys are all having a nice, Monday so far and let's have a great week. So I just finished working. I got dressed. I did my skincare routine and I have a lot of errands to run. I have to go to the post office, UPS. Um, I have to go to the mall and I'm going to go get my nails done and I have more work to do tonight. I, I don't have time to do it now because all these things close early. So I need to go like do the errands now before everything closes and then I'll come back and work some more. So this is just going to be a really busy Busy Monday. Right now I'm printing out a shipping label for Poshmark. I sold something a couple days ago, so I have to ship this out. And I do need to add more stuff to my closet. And if you guys haven't checked out my Poshmark, I have it linked in the description of all of my videos. You can just check it out anytime. I'm at UPS returning my November newly package. I'm returning it so I can get my December package or so I can select my December package. It's really easy to do. All you do is you put all the clothes back in the box that they sent you and they also give you the return shipping label so that you can easily send it back. So this is a reusable box. It's so heavy because all I get is coats now. So we're gonna return that. Hi guys, back from running all of my errands. I also got my nails done as you saw. I got pink and white ombre, so beautiful. These are dip nails and these are all my real nails except for this one. I had to get a tip because it broke. I went to the mall just to do returns and I ended up stopping by in Zara and didn't expect to get as much as I did. So I wanna show you guys what I got and then I have a lot of other things. Well, not a lot, but I have some other things I wanted to show you guys that I recently got. So I wanna start off with my glasses because I posted a photo of these on my Instagram and a lot of you guys were asking questions about where they're from so these are burberry is the brand but i bought them from glassesusa.com as you guys probably know i get all of my glasses from there and i am an avid glasses where i have a prescription i'm nearsighted which means i cannot see far away so i always need to wear glasses so i regularly get new glasses because my old ones will like get scratches on them or i'll lose them i lose all my glasses i don't know how so i order from them often because i just have to replace my old ones and i just like to have extra ones on hand and like in every room of my apartment every purse in my car everywhere and the whole experience to buy glasses on glassesusa.com is really convenient if you've never done it before you'll be shocked to see how easy it is all you have to do is you put in your prescription which you can get from your doctor and you just fill in your prescription and you select your lenses you can select like the type of features you want so I have blue light blocking on pretty much all my glasses and you can select from thousands of different frames they have designer ones like Burberry Armani they have Ray-Ban and they also have really affordable and cute frames to choose from so it's just a really great website ever since I started buying from them I have never purchased glasses in person because it's so expensive I saved so much money doing it online and it's just more convenient so um, yeah these are the first pair that I got and it's like a nude color and I'll come closer so you can see it's like a cat eye frame I love the frame and the color is really pretty and it came in this really nice Burberry glasses case it's like a black pebbled leather and then inside it came with the cleaning cloth they all come with cleaning cloths and i love the saying on them oh they changed it usually it says don't use a t-shirt because like you know how we all clean our glasses with our t-shirt this one says jolly holidays and a happy new pair oh i love that they're getting into the holiday spirit they always come with prescription cards it has your name on it and your prescription on the back so this is the other pair that i got it's a really pretty turtoise pattern it's like a light brown color 
I love these. I love turquoise for, for glasses. I think they're so fashionable and pretty. And the last pair of frames I got are actually sunglasses. So they have sunglasses also, and you can get prescription or non-prescription. So mine are obviously prescription. These ones are such a cute frame. And this type of sunglasses, I've been seeing them a lot on Instagram. This is a really big style right now for bloggers. So I really wanted to pick one up. I was actually gonna get one on Amazon, but I saw that they had this on Glasses USA and they are prescription. So I love having prescription sunglasses. I feel like I can finally be able to drive without being blinded by the sun. And I'm also teaming up with Glasses USA to do a giveaway. We're gonna give one of you guys a pair of non-premium glasses of your choice, any choice of lenses, frames, could be sunglasses, can be regular glasses can be prescription or non-prescription and that giveaway is going to be hosted on my instagram so head over to my instagram to enter that i will link post link in my description and all the other info you need i'll also link classes usa info and the links for all of these glasses that i showed so the next thing i got i'll show all the little things before my zara haul because my zara haul is kind of big so um i just have like one-off things to show so the next one is from urban outfitters it's just these plain white nike sneakers i thought they were so cute and i am loving white sneakers and I wanted just a really casual pair of tennis shoes that I can like walk around in and style with like jeans and sweatpants and just have a good pair of like basic white sneakers. And these are called the Nike Court Royal AC. They're just all white all over. I got size eight and a half. That's my true size. And they're really, really comfortable. And then I got another package from Fox and Rose. This is the Etsy jewelry brand that I have featured before. They have the cutest dainty jewelry packaging is adorable they come in these little plastic bags they're reusable like ziploc bags and so here we have a bunch of little earrings so we have a couple pairs of these like hoop huggies these ones have spikes on each and then i think is it like kind of have diamonds in it yeah i think it's it's hard to tell because they're so small and dainty and they're gold and then these ones oh these are so cute they have little keys on them that is so cute oh i love them and then they also sent two huggies these look like one silver and one gold here's the gold one and the silver one is the same as the gold one so that is so cute thank you fox and rose for sending those okay and last but not least my zara haul i got a couple of loungewear sets so the first one I got is this ribbed nude zip up sweater and I loved rib detailing for this winter and for the fall. A nice material and this was $39 and I got the matching pants with it. The pants were $35 and these are really big. They're wide legged on the bottom too i'll try all of these on so you guys can see what they look like on and the other set i got is this hoodie sweatpants set and this is the hoodie it's a little bit cropped and it's cinched on the bottom and i love the color it's like a sage green color i don't know if you can tell but such a nice pretty color and this one was 25 here are the sweatpants has a nice waistband and the only thing i wish is that the bottom was cinched in. I don't know how I will like how this looks. I'm gonna have to try it on and see how I like it. Cause I usually like sweatpants that are cinched on the bottom. The pants were 29. I got the pants of these in large. I got the hoodie in medium and I got these two in medium. And the last thing I got from Zara is this zip up hoodie. It's a black basic zip up hoodie. And I kind of just wanted one of these like zip ups um, just as an essential because I feel like it's such a good essential you can wear it with like anything underneath and Yeah, it's just your nice basic hoodie. So that's all I bought today I also bought something from Zara last week and I wanted to show you guys because I haven't shown it in a vlog yet I did share this on Instagram. I wore this in a post, but I got these leggings and they have a slit at the bottom I got lots of questions about these pants when I posted on Instagram I wore these with the white Nike sneakers that I just showed and it was just such a look. So I'll insert a photo of me wearing it on Instagram so you can see what that looks like on. But yeah, I love these. And I think these were like $25 or $30. And I wear mine in size large. So that's all for this vlog's haul. I'll try on all these Zara clothes now so you guys can see what they look like. Here is the zip-up hoodie. I love it. It's just such a cute and basic essential. Here's the green sweatpants sweatsuit. I think it's not bad. I actually like the, the bottom 
um, hemming. Like, I'm, I'm glad it's not cinched. Yeah, this one is really cute. I love the color and the style of it. And then here is the beige one. Super cute. Yeah, I love this. This one is cute. All right, so I'm about to head over to my parents' house. My mom cooked dinner, so I'm going to go eat dinner with her. And then I think... I'm gonna help her put up the tree. Usually me and my brother, we always would have put up our tree and then when we moved out, we both would like come back and put up the tree. So my brother actually can't leave his house right now. He lives in a group home for special needs adults and they're on lockdown. They're being super safe for COVID. So he can't leave his house. So I'll probably put up the tree by myself. We'll see how my mom feels. Okay, I'll see you guys when we're there. Mom made egg rolls and chicken adobo. So we're eating and then we're gonna put up the tree. Dad's working tonight. It's just me and my mom. Dad's working. He works the night shift at the hospital. He's working, right? Yeah, he's working. Here's our little tree. Seven and a half feet. We got this from, is this from Michael's mom? These are my favorite stockings. We've had these for like 10 years. We got them at like a store called Bombay in the mall. I don't know if that's a thing anymore, but they're so big and pretty. This is my favorite Santa. I love his aesthetic. Look at his outfit. Look at that coat. I need that coat. Where are we gonna put this? Are we gonna put him here? You can stay there for now. Clark family tree is up. It's so cute. We've had some of these ornaments for a long time. A lot of them are so cute. Joey, 2008. My grandma used to send us really cute ornaments. Joey's my brother. And we have here Brian, 2008. Brian's my dad. He's a respiratory therapist. There's another Joey one, 2007. Joey got a lot of ornaments. One says granddaughter. What else is cute? I mean, they're all cute, but... Oh, there's another one. This is probably another Joey one. Yep, Joey. Oh, this is my favorite one. We've literally had this for like 20 years. Santa sitting at his desk, writing his naughty and nice list. Of course, we have the Packers ornament that's up every year. This was my parents' first, first Christmas ornament. Our first Christmas. Jane and Brian, 1991, that's when they got married. So yeah, that's the tree. Super cute, I love it. All right guys, so I'm gonna end this vlog here. I'm gonna start editing and just hang out. I'm sleeping over here tonight, but I'll go back to my apartment tomorrow. I'll probably just sit here and edit in front of the tree. It's just so nice and peaceful to look at. Maybe I'll watch Christmas movies later, but yeah. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you guys tomorrow.